What's going on? Welcome back to 100% NUFC. So today it's Newcastle versus Liverpool, another match day vlog. I can't wait for it. One of the biggest games of the season up to now. There's going to be some big names on show and I just can't wait for Rafa Benitez to pit his wits against Jurgen Klopp. It's going to be a massive game for both clubs. It's always been a big, big fixture in terms of the Premier League and I really, really can't wait. There's going to be the Rafa Benitez banners. There's going to be a tribute as well to uh, Freddie Shepard as well. So again... Don't forget to go along and subscribe. I'm very, very close to 600 subscribers. As I'm speaking, I need nine. So go along, help us out, and try and reach that 600 subscriber milestone. And uh, yeah, how are the lads? And let's do this. Right, so I've uh, left the house, and uh, I'm on my way to meet Rob. So I just really can't wait for the game. I've left, it's currently quarter three, so we've still got a bit of a type of wait. And uh, I'm gonna go for a 1-1 one -one draw. I don't mind if we win, if we win that's a bonus but at the end of the day if we get a point that's great against a good Liverpool team we're not going to get judged on what we do against Liverpool this season we're going to get judged on what we do home against a smaller opposition like the Crystal Palaces, yeah, Watford, teams like that and uh, yeah, a fire, fire engine's just going past post that would affect the vlog a little bit but uh, yeah, let's get Rob's thoughts on the game Right, so I'm joined by Rob How's it going? <laughs> uh, so it's another vlog, uh, Liverpool, are you looking forward to it? Yes, I am. Um, I'm really hoping we can put in a good performance. Um, I think it's definitely going to be a tough game, but on the day, anything can happen. And uh, what's been the score today, mate? I've got one one. Yeah, I've I've got one one as well. I think we need to defend well today, and we need to. We haven't really scored many goals. Really, Lascelles is scoring all the goals, so we need Jocelyn to step up or whoever's playing to get a goal. Yeah, I think he's very right. And uh, yeah, don't forget to go along and subscribe to his channel. I'll leave a link down below in the description. Come on, the lads. Right, so the uh, teams are out, so Rafa's gone with Hoslo up front, uh, in the middle he's gone with Atsu, Ayuzi Perez, Richie, uh, Moreno and Cher Shelvio, like the defensive partnership. Uh, in the back he's gone with Manquio, Clark, Lascelles, Yed and then Gold Elliott, he's gone rather attack and he's actually kept Hoslo with the team as well, so uh, I'm a bit surprised Gale's not starting, but that is the team. So uh, yeah, I'm joined by Matty, mate, what do you think the score's going to be? 2-2. Two, 2-2. Two. Two, two.
Nervous times, but we're, we're holding up, we're doing good. So, uh, yeah, Mark Dog on, one of the local, Philip Coutinho, Oslo should be there, marking up. Great, uh, great finish by Coutinho more than anything, but uh, yeah, we've really got to start getting back into this game, get back to the rhythm where we were at, so, yeah, uh, one of the local, of course. Right, so uh, John Rice got it uh, one one half time. What do you think of that first half? Um, um, they played well, so they keep Liverpool very quick, of course. We played um, Salah at the time, but it was a quick goal by Coutinho. We don't get people like that goal. Like, it's just absolutely a quick goal. Um, it's three men in the first. Then come by John Rossami and then Josh Lowe. I mean, it was a good finish by... Um, Continue, but I feel, yeah. I feel like Hostel should have marked him up. Yeah, for, for, for a goal, yeah, definitely, mate. So, um, definitely, so we played well, so come out in the first half, I think, again. I mean, obviously, we, we did respond as well for a way, Hostel, so obviously, yeah, he has made up, yeah. made up for us. Yeah, for the ball, yeah, mate. And what are you going for, second half, mate? We're just going to finish one 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 um, Definitely, one one mate. Definitely. Ready, cheers, go, mate. Cheers. Yeah, so, yeah, it's half time, it's 1-1. Uh, one, one. Hopefully, we can, uh, we're sitting towards the Gallagher, so hopefully, we can try and get a second, but you just never know with this air team uh, let her with the lads so uh, yeah we're playing about an hour and it's still 1-1 Liverpool look the most likely to score but uh, the referees had a few dodgy decisions to uh, go against them at the moment and uh, yeah we've got a free kick played about 60 minutes of last year and uh, yeah it's one one so we're doing all right So it's 1-1, uh, one, one, uh, currently after 75 minutes, uh, Hayden's on. Uh, personally, I wouldn't have brought Hayden on, I would have brought on um, Gale on for uh, Hostel because it looks absolutely uh, knackered, but again, it might just uh, go to local save, I hope not. So uh, yeah, I've just recently left the ground and uh, it's finished 1-1, uh, a fantastic result for Newcastle. Uh, first half, Coutinho scored, brilliant uh, goal, it should have been defended better by uh, Hostel, we should have closed down a lot better, but then you know, Hostel again made up for it by uh, equalising after 36 minutes, half time came, then the second half came, Newcastle were pretty much sitting back, uh, Liverpool as you'd imagine, uh, with all the possession, you know, having all the opportunities, Salah was trying to create opportunities but was a little bit wasted, and uh, we know what happened two defender times. I believe Rafa should have uh, brought on Dwight Gale a lot earlier than he did because Hostel was very, very tired. And I just think it was a battle of performance. That's, that's way of uh, looking at this game. And I'm with Matty. Uh, did you enjoy that game, mate? Loved it, mate. Yeah. Um, because 
I said 1-1, one, one. Well, you said 2-2 two, two, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. I said just Liverpool. And uh, who stood out for you for Newcastle? Because we didn't really have that many opportunities, truth be told, but it was a battling performance, wasn't it? I thought that um, Yedlin and Mankeo had good games because obviously the full-backs were obviously going to be up against it with um, the quality of Sadio Mane and Mal Salah, but I thought we defended really well today, so credit to them. Yeah, so yeah, like I say, I'm going to um, end this play vlog here now. It's a bit dark because I'm walking past coaches as you speak. And uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I'm very, very close to 600 subscribers. And uh, a brilliant uh, performance by the lads. You can't go wrong. And it's a point, 10 points now. Uh, more than what Sunderland have got this season. So uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you all later.